Okay, so I'm back to do another video. This is a brief message. It's kind of just like a follow-up to the previous message I did about the organized stalking, spying, monitoring, and harassment. So you can go back and watch that video for details about that. But the message is still coming through about that situation. Um, some of you are going to come to find out as well, too, the um, gang stalking that some of you may have experienced even included your actual electronic devices. There's a strong um, Libra Gemini energy that was coming up very strongly around that, as well as a Cancer and a Taurus energy. These are individuals who are going to be going to jail. And I just wanted to share with some of y'all um, who were not aware, you know, what are some of the penalties that come along with some of the things that these individuals were doing. Um, Depending on where you live, you know, you can just educate yourself on the statutes and the penalties pertaining to that. But I do know in a lot of places that stalking is a felony. So um, that's something that they have been doing. Um, also, I'm getting identity theft as well, too. Um, I was seeing as well with that. Let me see. Something about aggravated identity theft was coming up as well, too. And stalking, um, yeah, it can't be up to a felony depending on where you live. So just educate yourself on that. Some of y'all might want to start consulting with like a criminal defense lawyer. Um, others of you, you might want to go ahead and get you a private eye because then that way these motherfuckers who think that they slick, you know what I'm saying, following you and trying to go covertly and undetected and make it seem, you know, like natural interactions with you the private eye will be able to detect that so they can be collecting information on your behalf and these motherfuckers is being stalked while they stalking you um but yeah so uh stalking can be up to a felony um i'm seeing it just depends it varies but i'm seeing like yeah five years in prison things of that nature um, I was looking up identity theft because that's what these individuals was doing as well, too. And that energy just keeps coming up in the messages about individuals creating um, fraud with identity theft. I'm just trying to see. If I can just get more information. I mean, you can look it up and find out, like I said, because it'll be different, maybe depending on where you are. But it just kind of really depends as well, too. Um, but, yeah, I, I would suggest you all start going ahead consulting, okay, with your legal representation. Get you a nice criminal defense lawyer. Um, either you can go ahead and hire your own private eye or you could work with your criminal defense attorney to um, help you um, with getting in contact with a private eye um, agency because some of them do work with them um, especially when it comes to situations pertaining to like identity theft and stalking and harassment and things of that nature and gang stalking 
So um, it just depends on who you consult. Um, you just kind of got to do your own research where you are. But yeah, I would just say um, be very vigilant. Um, for some of you, you know who these individuals are. For others of you, it's, it's more individuals involved that you're not even aware of. And it's, it's individuals who um, they may not think that you know, but you know. Um, they thought that they were very slick with what they were doing. But at the same time, this is the thing. Like, people don't be knowing who they be coming to. And this is the thing when people start targeting people who they don't even know who they are. You know what I'm saying? Like, they have no idea who you are. Like, for all they know, you could be an undercover cop. You know what I'm saying? So people really got to be mindful doing stupid shit out here like that. But that's why there is consequences for the shit that people do. You know what I'm saying? Because you can't just be going around thinking that you're just going to get over on good people. Um, trying to fuck over people who didn't mean you any harm or never did anything to you or trying to get people caught up in shit just because you know they want to live some type of lifestyle beyond their fucking means because that's really what it boils down to like there really is no point besides this because motherfuckers is coming up in the fucking five of pinnacles about to lose it all you know what i'm saying because they don't know how to fucking manage their time their money their resources and live the quality of life that they desire to live without trying to fucking get over on another person so it is what it is. But yeah, this was just a follow up to that previous message. Just real brief. Like I said, just make sure you go ahead, start looking up um, and consulting individuals, cr criminal defense attorneys, private eye, and just any other um, resources that you come across um, that would be assist of assistance to you when it comes to those of you who have dealt with situations like this. Okay. Um, have a blessed day.